You really have to admire the legal and law enforcement community in this country. Take Louis Free. Here's a guy that served in the Reagan Justice Department, was appointed to the federal bench by George H.W. Bush, and handpicked to head the FBI by President Bill Clinton. I mean, you're topping out on the charts of law enforcement in this country with that kind of pedigree. And clearly, there are expectations that come with that kind of background. Now, we could not have been happier when we found out that Louis Free was to be the trustee of the MF Global bankruptcy. That turned a potential hazard for the entire industry into a spectacular moneymaker for us. MF Global stole their clients' funds, and no one has been arrested yet. One of the top law enforcement people in the country has been on the case for over six months, and no one has been charged. Try as he might, with paper trails everywhere and $1.6 billion gone missing, he could not find out who did what. But you know, Louis Free was working really hard at it, along with the people he asked to stick around MF Global to help him sleuth this thing down. That's right. Most of the team he assembled were the top guys from MF Global. And if they couldn't help Louis Free find the evidence of their own wrongdoing, then who could? I mean, really. And Louis wanted to reward them for their help in not solving the case. So he asked the bankruptcy judge to approve bonuses for these financial wizards. And he wanted them paid right now. Never mind that the MF Global clients hadn't gotten their money back. Nothing should keep one of us from our bonuses. Louis. Louis, with a justice system like that, our lucre be free.